Hey guys, Jules Kane here, back again with another piano tutorial. This time we're going to go through the song I Owe You by Kevin Lemons. This song was written and recorded in the key of D flat, modulates up to D, then up to E flat, and we're going to end off in E major. Okay, so let's start off with the intro. Beautiful, very nice chord voicings, yet a simple progression when you break it down. So you're going to start off on the 1, I like the D flat major 9 voicing. Then you're going to play a minor 4 over 1, so that's going to be an F sharp minor over D flat. And you can play out the melody on the top if you like. We're gonna go to a nice voicing on the five. So an A flat nine thirteen. I'm gonna do this little slur here. And then back to the D flat major nine voicing. And you hear that little bass line there, which I like. So you're going to start on the 1, for the D-flat major 7, go to the 2, E-flat major 7, D-flat over F, so this is a voicing on the 3, and then an F-sharp major 7, so this is voicing on the 4, and then back to the 1. Problems! Now a 7, 3, 6, we're going to do a minor 7, flat 5. Then we're going to do an F altered dominant for the 3. So that's going to be an F7 sharp 9 sharp 5. Now we're going to do this very cool B flat major 9 on the 6. Okay, now let's take it home with a nice 2 5 1. We're gonna play a voicing on the two, which is E flat 13 sus. So I like to think of this as an F minor seven on my right hand, and on my left hand, playing just the shell of an E flat minor seven or a dominant seven. So E flat, D flat. Play that F minor seven on your right hand. Now we're gonna switch it to an E flat nine 13 sharp 11, which is basically taking that F minor seven to an F major. Actually, it's better without the G on the first one. Okay, G is optional there. Then we're going to go to the 5 for a 9 sus 4 voicing, which is just an F sharp over A flat. Right? Now we're going to walk up to the 1 with a 6 7 1. F sharp over B flat, 6. A flat over C for the 7. This is a 5 over 7. And then the 1. Okay, now we're going to do a 6, 2, 5, 1. The voicings are really nice here. It sounds like... Okay, so that was just a 6, 2, 5. Alright, so here for the 6, we're playing an F7 sharp 9 sharp 5 now by the way with this whole passage we're playing a melody on our right hand so for each chord so 
So you're here. Okay, so F7 dominant to a B flat 9 sus4. Keep the melody going. Now we go back to that E flat chord we're going to. So this is on the 2. E flat 9, 13 sharp 11. On the 5, we're playing an F sharp chord. So just playing the arpeggio. And then we're going to change to an F major chord and playing a A flat dominant on our left hand. That makes a very nice A flat 13 flat 9. Very cool voicings here. And then back to the one. And that's the whole intro. So, uh, actually there's one more progression in the intros, because they're going to play it again. So, you are my all and all. You're going to hear him play this nice passage. flat 5, play a minor 7 flat 5, G minor 7 flat 5, to the 4, we're going to play a minor 6, F sharp minor 6, F sharp minor, okay, for this one, I think, I think we'll play an E diminished 7 this time, okay, and so that's for the flat 3, now the 2, minor 7, for the five, we're going to go back to that 13 flat nine. So it sounds like. Now we're going to get ready for the regular part of the song. Small. Sus4. Okay, and then we're gonna go to a nice 251. Play a nice E flat 9 13. down from B flat chromatic down to G Start singing. It's the same chords we've covered with the intro. You are my all in all. You hear me when I call. No matter problems, great or small, I owe you, owe you everything. And again. Do, do, do. 
Okay, now as we're moving to the bridge, we can play a little pentatonic. Lord, I owe you my life. You're playing just three chords. You're starting on the three. You can play it like a minor nine. I'm sorry, that was a two for an E flat minor nine. Three, F7, dominant, uh, alter dominant, and then we can go to uh, B flat minor nine on a six. And try to give it some sort of bass line. Break out, go to the nice alter dom again for B flat seven sharp nine sharp five, and then I O U. Go to a two for an E flat nine or the E flat nine thirteen voicing, and you hear this movement here. Start on a C minor, drop it down. So they do that. And do it again. Now we're going to do a key change, go up a half a step to D. Okay, so when we go to the key of D, we're going to start off on the 6, and then we're going to go to the 2 with an E minor 9, F sharp 7, sharp 9, sharp 5, so alter dominant on the 3, and then we're going to uh, the 6, and we're playing a 9 sus 4. Okay, so it's the same progression that we were just playing in D flat. We're going to go to the E minor 9, F sharp, alter dominant, the 3, the 6. Okay, do it again. And then when we break out, make it a dominant. Okay, and then we're going to go to the 2 of D. We're going to do a 2 5 1. I own you. Then we're going to go to E flat. We're going to play the f uh, four over five, so that'll be playing a B, a B flat nine sus four. So A flat, right? Then we're going to go to the six, play alter dominant, and same progression. Same thing in E. Okay, so after E flat, we're going to go to same 4 over 5. Then we're going to go to the 6 here. And it's the same progression. So actually, it's going to be F sharp. I'm going to make it an F sharp minor 9. A flat seven sharp five and a D flat nine sus four. Okay, and then we're going to go into a different groove here. They're going to go to a so what they're really doing. It's kind of like you're playing an F sharp minor seven. And you're just switching over from the, you're playing the melody here. And you're gonna go to an 
A flat seven, sharp nine, sharp five. So you're gonna even add this B in there. And then for the end of the song, you're going to break out to here. Nice 2 5 1 and E. I own you. I own you. Everything. And then the run. So, E flat, I mean uh, F sharp, 7. And then a B9 sus4. Just so play that A over B. B over E flat to E. All right, and that was the whole song of I Owe You by Kevin Lemons. Thank you guys so much. I'll be back with some more tutorials. Hey, if you want charts, Go check out my website, JulesKane.com. You'll find charts and sheet music to all of my songs, and you'll be able to request your own sheet music and your own MIDI files, also piano lessons. So please check that out. Until next time, take care, guys.